for another NBA 2K21 of the NBA fi Finals parts of the two teams in Eastern Conference. But this is the Eastern Conference of the Finals as the Bucks meet to face again to do since last season the Sixers. Well this is what they really want but this is what they really want to keep it going. They want to rematch it again since last season of the postseason and the first season as the Bucks took a win right over the Sixers, but this is what they really want to keep an eye on them to give it a all. So it seems like it's time to hit this part to make a city to help them out. And then a statement for them will be, uh, I mean the city part will be blue. So. You're gonna find out what happens here. I know Giannis was the Finals MVP, but what about 2K? What about 2K21 on a 2K Sports? Well, you'll find out. We'll see what happens at this point if the game is on the run. So it's time to hit the first game here at Philadelphia, where the prize of the money to win the first game. So, the 2K TV Awards, the prize will contain these parts, and if you don't want to miss this one out, the new cover, uh, they are bringing the prize pack with my team cards, Kobe Bryant, and also with some coins here too. And if you haven't seen the events, we got the real stars here to find out, but you will have to see again soon for next season. So that's all we have here today. Yeah, if you want to watch this right now, go ahead. I, I recommend you watching this part. But anyway, it's time to hit Eastern Conference on the side. And Joel Embiid ain't the bell. There you go. That means we are in Eastern Conference to start off. And that's me, your 76ers! And the shooting guard is the shape. 6 feet and inches, number 31, Sam! A small four position. A six four seven inches. Number fourteen. Danny Green. The other point guard position. Six three two inches. Number twenty five. And Simmons. Simmons. And the other four position. It's six foot eight. Number twelve. Now Bias Harris. And from small forward, the center, the Bucicis, from Kansas City, number 21, Joel, the process, and B! 
And your head coach for the Sixers, Doc Rivers. First game here tonight is about to go crazy here as the Sixers from 2K Sports has made again this time for the season to do another matchup. And right now, here's David Aldridge reporting on the sideline. Dave? Hey, Kevin, with the Sixers having scoring struggles on occasion, some are saying that the duo of Ben Simmons and Joel Embiid is doomed. Embiid disagrees strongly, saying, look at what we've done. It can work, and it's going to work. Simmons agreed, saying, it takes time. I love playing with Joel, and I know he feels the same. With our talent, it's scary how good we can be. Guys? Growing together. Growing together, and it's Embiid and Simmons. Thanks, David. Thanks, Dean. Right now, the starting lineups are right on the board. Key matchup is Giannis Antetokounmpo versus Tobias Harris. And on point guard position, key matchup is Ben Simmons versus Drew Holiday. Plus, it's Dante DiVincenzo versus Seth Curry. And Chris Middleton against the other player that we are talked about it before. You know what we are seeing it right from the money. It's Danny Green. And from point four, and from the center, Brooke Lopez against Joel Embiid. Here we go. First game starts now. As the Bucks wins the jump ball, we start now here for the first time. I mean, a second one to take a second consecutive win here for the Eastern Conference if they have one. Middleton missing the three. He never had a shot ability to take it off from here. We have many fans out there. Curry up. Free roll. Seth Curry. Curry. Girardi pass to Dante DiVincenzo right to Lopez. Middleton, another angle, ties the game up. Middleton takes his first three-pointer here for the night in game one for the Eastern Conference. Simmons, pass to Harris, on onto the Kupo. On Simmons, oh, he right around on Brook Lopez. He did not see that one before. This is what he really wanted. Dante DiVincenzo, pass over to Middleton. Right up again, Middleton, just good. Middleton takes the number two. He got his first bucket for two. Simmons, right on Harris. On a Kupo, trying to work his way around a bit. And now he's with, on, with Joel B Back to Tobias Harris, and that's good. Tobias Harris takes the two-pointer. On a Kupo to Middleton. Middleton right to DiVincenzo. DiVincenzo up already. And he slowly comes around here. As Middleton try to work his way around, try to help DiVincenzo out. Finding a look is MB. On Brook Lopez. Shot is good. MB gets his first bucket here. And we talked about it before. Why did they are why did the Sixers came up first? Well, it's because of what they have done so far. The first seed, they worked really hard. They just made it. They clinched the playoffs here on the top start, but suddenly fell short because the Atlanta Hawks beat them in the second round. So that's what they did already. But I'm assuming that Trey Young has never left the team. They have to do it now. What could they do? Well, we have to find out which team is he going to play next. If not, and he might be in trouble already. He's just staying with the Hawks. Joel and B, second bucket of the night. <clears throat> DiVincenzo, right to Holiday. Holiday over to Middleton. Holiday. Three pointer. The shot is missed away. Here's Simmons. Right on Drew Holiday. He goes up. Oh, he makes a dunk. This is crazy enough to see him go by. But right now, here's Middleton. I mean, Holiday. Middleton trying to look his way around freely. Holiday. On the Kubo. Right around Tobias Harris. Oh, it's 
and B with the block. The process takes the first block. Oh, DiVincenzo out of, out of steal. First turnover on Philadelphia. And shot's good. It's Chris Middleton making a shot. First foul is called on Tobias Harris. Now will be a first team foul on Philadelphia. New change here as Forbes is checked in for DiVincenzo. And the Sixers are also making changes here. Green, Harris, and Simmons are checked out. Hill has moved over. Harris and Simmons are moved over to the Everguard. Small forward and point forward. Chris Middleton takes the first free throw here. He has eight points. They're down by one. Here's Hill. Pass to Embiid. He goes right again. And B. Third basket goes in. Drew Holiday right to Anna Cooper. They're trying to want to mess on him. Anna Cooper to Forbes. Finding his up Lopez. Anna Cooper up. The shot with the way. Here's the fast break. Shot's good. Ben Simmons taking a two pointer. It's Drew Holiday with the foul. Now, I might be saying a quote. Why are they doing the Bucks again? Well, play as the Bucks. Well, uh, it's after because of the first season of how, how well they have just played for a regular season. That's what I chose for. <laughs> and not even the only thing that I really wanted to do. So I got a lot of I got a lot of judgment to say on this one. So yeah, I have to do it. <clears throat> Expecting to see what happens. Here's um, here's Ben Simmons with one free throw at the line. He gets one in. You're up by six at that point. Here's Holiday. Holiday to Forbes. Forbes right to Holiday. Moves over to Connaughton. He's right on Batiste Bible. Drew Holiday for three. And the first rebound goes on is Jake Milton. Simmons. Alley -oop. Oh, yeah, baby. It's D.Y. Howard with the dunk. Oh, yeah. We talked about this one before. I know that D.Y. Howard is like putting it on a roll here. Holiday right to Tucker. Right over is Connaughton. Now screen coming in is Bobby Portis. Coming in. Huff on the run. Oh, get it off of here. <clears throat> D.Y. Howard just takes the ball away and just smack it. Another jam in there. It's Simmons with the drive. Nine points, eight and a paint. Forbes, right to Tucker. Holiday to Forbes. Connaughton for three. That's good. His first three-pointer is right on the mark. And right now they are under 90 seconds to play here in the first quarter. Hill working his way around frequently. Simmons on the screen. He's not giving up on him, he's just trying. And Hill will take the layup. First time out, Milwaukee. 1 11 to go here in the first quarter. But the offense is just slowing things down. They're going to need to try to figure this out on an outer carry. There's Franklin and Dog, the mascot for the Sixers. Let's see here. Pick and rolls we'll see here. We'll see what happens at that point. I'm starting out Girardi. I'm going to make a new change out there. As I'm going to bring, uh, bring DiVincenzo in, and then I'm going to go ahead and move Forbes to the point guard. Just one change out there. 
new change here. I have it out. And now Cork Moss of Maxi is checked in for Simmons and five and Fibel moving it over to point forward. Tucker take a first shot. This doesn't bite the dust. He gets a very first miss three-pointer. Tucker, what a great defender here. He's got a first rebound here on right on Maxi. There's a sixer sound. Right over is Portis. Forbes cuts around. Shot's good. Forbes got his first bucket here. And right now, only under 30 seconds here. Here's George Hill. He finds Fiable. Tucker on him. Howard against Portis finds Fiable. Oh, Tucker! He blocked the first shot on Fiable. That's the wrong one, sorry. Connaughton for three. And he gives it back. It looks like DiVincenzo made the, made the assist. And the quarter is closed already. 24 to 20. We're just getting started here for the first game here of West Eastern Conference. We'll be right back for the second quarter when once this is once it comes back up. You gotta finish the job. You gotta get it done. But I'm just, you know, I'm happy from all that experience that we learned. And we came back and we have a goal in that head. We motivated. Oh. And for those of you who don't know here about the what happened to Giannis, well, his team was being beaten up here by the Raptors here in game six. This was happened here like two years ago. And um, once in 2022 has arrived, it will be now three years ago. I'm not that sure why uh, why Giannis kept losing, but this is what he really needs to know. And if he tries again, well, this is what he really wants to do, beat the Raptors at it twice to see what they could do. And uh, hopefully they're going to be playing here at the Toronto. So yeah, I think next season that we're going to be doing it. We'll see what happens then. Connaughton driving in. Smooth run. <clears throat> Sorry. Here's Maxi. He has never just tried it before, but he will do it at this point. Korkmaz got his first bucket here, so let's see what he does again. Korkmaz on DiVincenzo. I mean, Connaughton. Hill over Forbes. The three-pointer can't connect. DiVincenzo, tight squeeze here, but it does not manage to make the three. Korkmaz finds Maxi, and he's got a first bucket here. Tyrese Maxi just started it after he has made his draft back in 2020. On this part of the game, like he had never faced it before. So it's time to make some new changes here for the, for the Bucks. I'm going to have Drew Holiday get back in there, and then this guy out, as, um, as, um, I'm going to go ahead and, uh, I'm going to have to, uh, try to watch that play here, I, I want, I'm going to see what, what he can do, I don't know where Chris Middleton is at, but what the heck. Stuff out of him. I'm gonna bring Drew Holiday back in. And then we're gonna switch it up. Alright. New changes here for the Sixers and the Bucks as Chris Middleton is checked back in for Pat Connaughton. And then Drew Holiday is checked in for Forbes. And Connaughton moves over to shooting guard as Steven is checked out. And I the Cupo here for PJ Tucker with Brooke Lopez. And all five players are checked checked in. But only Tyrese Maxey in a point guard. And the foul, first one called on the Sixers is Joel Embiid. Brooke Lopez will go to the three for a line to shoot two. This game is just like a worst, worst play scenario to make a disaster out of it.
This is what should ever happen here at that point. It should never happen like that before. The first free throw for Lopez is good. They're trying it very hard. They're just working on it. The second free throw for Brook Lopez is good. He's got his first bucket on. And we talked about it before, about Joel and Bia, of how it all started here before he made his draft. After Allen Iverson, he was able to play his game, but this wasn't the only man that he was going to try to earn it. Not the other man can defend it already, as also Dr. Dr. Julie, Julius Irving was making his way to see what happens to him. And what they need to know? Well, they got a lot of things to tell for. Most plays are not even the same way. It's amazing to see them. Conate missed the three-pointer. Another change up here for Joel B rebounds. Eight year for Conate. Three out of five, only two made it in. Harris right to the Curry up. Free ball, Steph Curry! Curry! Danny Green, I think. I don't know. I don't know if I said it right, but correct me. And over again, Lopez. Back to Adetokounmpo. The Greek freak inside. Oh, what a slam. Timeout on the Sixers. There'll be four or three left to go. Good play out there. A little, uh, little quick break in between. There might be more out there. I'm going to sub out uh, Connaughton. I'm going to bring DiVincenzo back in and make a starting five group. I'm going to need to patient the offense a little bit more. I'm just going to need to find a pick and rolls. Just one change here for the Bucks, And then this should all turn out to be a starting five on the group. Right now, Joel Embiid just trying to just work their way around. Now Ben Simmons has checked in too. Well, that's perfect. Green up. Three misses, rebound, oh! Good play out there for Joel Embiid and Giannis Antetokounmpo would have taken the block but that wasn't able to cover it right at the center. Antetokounmpo for three. He doesn't go in that time, he missed out with the first three pointer. Curry and he's fouled by Brook Lopez. This will be his first personal on Milwaukee. Seth Curry will take two free throws at the free throw line. About to go save him, save him, worry to worry. Not uh, hard happens. Curry hits the first free throw. And talking to his brother by Stephen Curry, he was telling him what he was going to do here, of what what to give him a, uh, a, total, uh, a total scores out there. But maybe this time is giving him a trouble. Not just real trouble, but uh, just half. If Seth Curry makes it for the next season, then he will be able to play with them right along the board. So let's see how well he does. Oh, on a Kubo, he just goes in there wide alone. That's just like no answer at that point. That's all you can care about. Ben Simmons, right on Dante DiVincenzo, and he steals it. Here's the two on one fast break. Middleton scoops, and he takes a dive to take two points. You're down by five with under three minutes. Simmons trying to work his way around. 
Find some Paris and a scoop around her again. That will be another assist by Ben Simmons. Turnover is Middleton. Middleton over to the Giannis. On a Cooper again. And oh, oh, fight for a rebound. Oh, he took it away. And Green, free ball, Danny Green. And Simmons. Two minutes, two minutes in the first half. Here's, uh, here's Curry. He's driving all alone again. Oh, and now the turn is on Giannis out of the Kubo. The shot was way early. 140 to go. Paris up. The rebound was taken over by Giannis, the Greek freak. Dante DiVincenzo, wide open. Excellent shot. And they're down by seven. Here's the, um, Simmons as he will take the call. Timeout Sixers. 122 left to play here in the first half. Not a lot of play out there, but not a pretty good momentum of what they're, what they're going to be doing here to give it on that run. Since Drew Holiday is just losing uh, losing out a lot of energy, I'm just going to make sure we can limit it and push the pace a little bit more. Pick and rolls again. I need uh, Giannis to get in there. And try to give it up on the run. So we have two turnovers on the Bucks, three turnovers on the Sixers, and and its blocks are even. Three steals on the Bucks, two on the Sixers. A lot of hard happening, but there might be much more to give it up. And now new switches here for the Sixers are on the board as five oval check in. Right over is Hill, with 118 left to go. Forbes on Hill. Giannis will sit down. Oh, are well, you perfect for Ben Simmons. George Hill, had, George Hill had helped him very nicely. Middleton right to DiVincenzo, right back to Middleton. Taking a three look, and it's good. Middleton is keeping things going with only 56.9 seconds. It's 42-36. Sixers still in control. Alley-oop. Another one success. And George Hill, yep, you could tell that one. That play was coming out perfect. Portis, right to DiVincenzo. Forbes. Oh, he was just slate. But he made it. <laughs> well, thank you. Well, he just, Forbes is just not always lucky enough for him. Another success by you. Portis would have blocked that, blocked that pass. But it was too late. Middleton, another three. Nobody was open, but he missed it again. Five all coming in. We rebounded up. 10 seconds gone here for the first half. Middleton attacking, and the foul gives up as D.Y. Howard draws his first personal. Second team foul on the Sixers. With 7.6 to go, shooting two at the free throw line, Chris Middleton. He has 13 right now, but, uh, but his shot has to be careful at that moment. His first free throw was good. Not just a dynamic duo, but this is all what he really thinks. Only two fouls here for the, for the Milwaukee Bucks. <clears throat> Very nice to see one of his players uh, score the point buckets. Not just only the team. Chris Middleton hits two free throws here. And Simmons will try to hit the hit the shot clock with the game clock. Buzzbeater! And not enough. 
that will be the end of the first half, 46 to 41. And now let's catch you to David Aldridge. Dave? Thanks, Brooke. Where is this team right now? Oh, I'm so excited, you know. It's really thrilling to come out with such a great for you guys every night, you know, and uh, play basketball, you know. It's just it's a lot of fun. Smiles on your face, Brooke. Thanks for the time. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, DA. Be right back after this one. Stand by. Second half of basketball is ready to go as we are taking a look one quick way to see what happens. It's Ben Simmons just trying to work his way to his cross team quickly, but he has managed to make his way. 15 points, one rebound, three assists. Not bad at all for my, for my only rookie player, but he really had it all. But that is just what he really needs in order for him to just keep an eye on. So here we go. All players regain their game to Gatorades and ready to go for the start of the second half. Curry finding Di Vincenzo, his screen was on MB. Now Brook Lopez is on MB here and he was taking a fade. Around Curry is the right half of time. That's good. Number two pointer here carried out. Right along here on the Cooper pass to Holiday. Holiday trying in. And he's short. Simmons draws the foul. It will be another one here on the Sixers. It's number three. Drew Holiday getting the line to shoot two. They're trying to make history here, but this is what they are expecting to do to just see what they've done. Not the only time, I really hate that. First free throw is good. And one more look. And the second free throw drops in. Not really just uh, working off full, but this is what they really want. Simmons on Drew Holiday. Again, and he's fouled and won. That counts the dub as Brooke Lopez received his second. Not even picking it up, but he was sometimes late. Not really showing up that time, but uh, no, no offense with that call. And just work his way around freely. Then Simmons just going to shoot at the free throw line to shoot one. It's very hard to contrive. They can try to just reach it. Simmons doesn't hit that. It's Steven Chenzo. Oh. Oh, then Steven Chenzo getting it back in there. Nine points. They're down by five. Simmons on Drew Holiday. Remember, look. Curry open. Look. On cover is Steven Chenzo. He blocked it. Almost turned the backcourt. All around Giannis. And Curry still has it out there. Around Brook Lopez. That's good. We're still up already. But Giannis on the Cooper is not finished yet. Bad timing. Not a good start for him. But that was very hard for him to, uh, to train. Here's uh, Ben Simmons on Drew Holiday again. Mariana Carey, Tobias Harris. And Giannis attempted to steal it, but he was reached and fouled right on the board as the referee would have called it. So that was the first block here as Joel Embiid knocks the ball away. That was the best play that was ever used. It didn't really help at all, but that was just hard for him to score by to give that one a call. Simmons on holiday. Around again. Foul! On Giannis Anacupo, his second personal 13 foul on the on Milwaukee. Mike Budenholzer's just got a little disappointment out there because the team 
is in the first seed, but they want to fight for revenge and have second consecutive runs for this score. Let's see what Joel Embiid has. Embiid hits the first free throw. He's not the only guy who wants to just to block it all. He wants to like put the pressure on, but that is what he really needs to deserve it. His gaming is just quite often as he really wants. And just like that before, uh, the other game was just okay, but DiVincenzo, oh yep, yep, you got trouble already here. Seth Curry with the foul. And it looks like DiVincenzo is just barely racing toward the rim, right from the one-on-one -on -one attack. It's very, it's going to be very hard for him to just, uh, just try to look on the, on the top timing of this shot. Don't rush it, he said. Don't rush the rim. Just find an open man and don't leave him out. If, you was, if nobody's open, then you just have to go by yourself. You have, to, you have to go all alone. All alone. First free throw is good for DiVincenzo. At that point, only 5.02 to go. <clears throat> and a second free throw for Dante DiVincenzo is good. 11 points for Dante DiVincenzo. Here's Ben Simmons on holiday. Ben Simmons trying to work her way around here. Harris on Anacupo. Blocking, blocking the pass, but it was knocked off. Green has recovered. He finds Simmons. All around. But sometimes, oh, what a save me here. Green up. Free ball. No good. Nice deed. Lopez blocked the shot. Dante DiVincenzo, he slammed it. And it now has 13 points in this game. They're trying to work their way around uh, with only 4 15 remaining. Holiday on Simmons. And now it's Curry against DiVincenzo. And beat on Lopez. He got a first block out. He got a good crack of it. Four to shoot. Simmons, trying to work up. No good here. Anacupo with the rebound. He just needs to be careful. Anacupo only one rebound. Four rebounds, I meant. Only one assist. Oh, Anacupo. Oh, you got lucky here. Anacupo made that shot really good. And now the fouls give it on. Danny Green, his first. You can't mess with the Greek freak of what he was just playing. He's just like right around and says, nope. That's how time goes. When the history gets there, it's gonna be me. Well, you just don't you just don't want to uh, get technical fouls at it. It's going to be off off the moment like you have never seen it before. Ida Cooper, one free throw to give. And he makes it. Ida Cooper has seven points in this game, and now they're not counting. How rude. Hill finds MB. Harris, trying to roll it in. Would have gotten himself out of the way. Would have gone to throw MB, but it's on Hill instead. Lopez on Arna Kupo. Drives again. Shoots up, and that's good. Arna Kupo has nine. And they're down by two. Just three minutes left here in the third quarter. Holiday on Hill. Passes to Harris. Spin move. It's rebounded up on Embiid. Oh, ah, uh, ball loose 
it's Bucks ball. Milwaukee going the other way, and now the new change here as Ana Cupo is check and give it out. Brooke Lopez will move to small forward, and three other players are just making new changes. Right now, Holiday is just really giving things up here. Only four assists, only made two in that point. Drew Holiday coming back, and yes, sir, he did. Drew Holiday got the lead up by one. First lead in game one. Hill against Drew Holiday. Harris attacking inside, and it's good. They're on the switchback. Two ten to go. He finds Tucker. Firing over Holiday. Two minutes. Two minutes in the third quarter. Wow, Drew Holiday doesn't seemingly really want to mess things up. He has seven points, and now he's on. He's up already. So yeah, he just he just faced it up already. He in the second half, and the first half was giving him a slow tightness. Forbes with a rebound here. 135 left to play here in the third quarter. Now we move roll over to 90 seconds. Portis for three. That's good. He's got his first three-pointer and Forbes with these assists. Lopez seemingly he really would like to see what he can do. But this part of the defense is no longer what they have done. And B. Bill, good pass. I don't know who, who was it on, but uh, uh, <laughs> I'm not sure which one it is, so you can't tell me where, where which one it is. Tucker never got a bucket here. Bucker, back to Lopez. Lopez to Holiday. Holiday! Oh, yeah. I know that Holiday was able to do it. Brooke Lopez wanted to make sure he's getting there, get, getting there close. Lopez got six assists here tonight for game one. Well play out there. Harris against Lopez. All around Tucker, and one! Tobias Harris reaching out with another look out there, and B.J. Tucker just got fouled by the ref. His first foul was being increasing up to his next foul. And now Middleton and DiVincenzo will check in for Brooke Lopez and Forbes. And one shot coming will be Tobias Harris. Plus, we make some new changes here as Tobias Harris switched over to point forward as Fievel checked in. Middleton's also checked in as two from Korkmaz. And they're coming in now. 30 seconds. TV chance are right the holiday. Cutting around in, in and out angle. A little bit of squibbly line. Demon Chenzo receiving 15 points out there, and now here comes Milton. He's up. Shake. Milton. He's got his first one. In the second half. 10 seconds to go. On a lockdown, DiVincenzo. P.J. Tucker, will he get it? Well, nothing here on the third, but that will end up the third quarter. 66-65 is your score. We'll find out what that happens with fourth quarter and see who wins the first game when we come back. Don't go anywhere as we will get the coverage here on Eastern Conference Finals on NBA 2K21. And now let's check out the assist of a game presented by State Farm. Well, Sixers are doing really well out there, and not without the Bucks. They got Ana de Cupo really looking like he's like settling it down a bit. But for Brooke Lopez, this is what he really wants, and enjoy him what he got to do. This is it. One last quarter left here. Bucks and the Sixers, who will win the first one. Holiday finding his Portis. He got his first three-pointer here for tonight as they are all fueled up and ready to go for the final one. Drew Holiday, and he's fouled. 
by Ben Simmons. His second personal has been given up as the Sixers have added another team foul. Drew Holiday will have to step back to the free throw line to shoot two. To give him a hard time out there. What a what a different. What a difficulty here. His first shot has handled it all. They're still right up ahead of each other right now. And only Drew Holiday is like receiving the most careers better than the New Orleans Pelicans. Not without the option to be played back with, uh, with the Indiana Pacers for this part of the game. It's not really easy. He makes both. It's 11 points for Holiday as they're up by three. Howard on Simmons. Screen is on Howard. Up again. Whoa! Did you see that? Wow. That play was just insane. We got to put a slow motion on here. Before I begin, let's take a look at one more time here for this part. Whoops. Hold on a second. Let me just go back from here. Watch that play one more time. And and check out his foot. And you can see here he is just knocking it. Wow. Bam. That's what you could just totally see of what his play was coming in for like. And now um and on this camera angle, it's just like nothing else that you can see here. And here it goes. Wow. That was awesome. Awesome play out there here, D.Y. Howard. In the meantime, I'll, I'll try Jeff Teague out and see what he does. And Middleton out, I'm going to bring back uh, Connaughton. And Forbes back in. I'm really, up, I'm really having a lot of struggle here to do myself a huge favor to make a win as a pro. But this isn't what I really would like to see what happens. Alright, new changing here from Milwaukee is up. Four players are checked out. Four players are checked in. Ana Kupo's back and again once more. Ana Kupo, right around Howard. Shot trouble. Danny Green with the foul. His second. And another team foul is given up here on the Sixers. Now there's a bunch of complaining of uh, Giannis Ana Kupo's drive. They do not want to bump him out. That's not a good sign. We wanted to just, uh, they, they, we wanted to just, uh, just, uh, just keep an eye on him, but don't, like, get rid of it. If Anacupo bumps him, that will be an offensive foul. Kind of tough looking. Shot's good for Anacupo. He makes a number one in the good history here. Ten points. One more left. It's a both. Anacupo receiving 11 points out there. We only are down to 623 left here at 70 to 67. Shake Milton up on fours. He drives, shoots good. Shake Milton, another two-pointer. And they are getting close. Forbes, right to Tucker, right around T. Now he goes right to Connaughton. Up and over, whoa! Whoa, Connaughton, slow it down with that pace already. He was like right around D.Y. Howard. He almost would have tripped him up already. Would have just gotten like a foul. Come on, man. That would have been a better idea to do it. Up, and the revenge is quiz on. It's another one for Ben Simmons here tonight. 19 points, 18 in the paint. Well done out there. Now, Anna Cooper wanted to switch it off. He finds uh, Forbes. Now he face off to Tucker. 
Finding over fours. Fours, driving up. Shot, missed again. It's 72-71 score. Simmons trying to seek it out directly. Green to Milton. Teague with him. He passes to Simmons. Forbes up around, and it's good for Simmons. He has the lead up by one, but on the Kubo. Uh-oh, uh-oh, watch out, watch out. Yep, you know what happens? Anacupo says the game is not done yet. He's still trying to keep an eye on him. Next time out is on the Sixers. 4.37 to go here. It's only the game still close at that moment. But uh, three timeouts will be given up in, in each team. But there's a lot of them to be done. So we're not sure what will come out here, but this might be more out there to seek in at that moment. I'm going to make some change. Um, I'm going to find out what will happen, so don't let me get frustrated again. We got a new change here coming in for, uh, for the Bucks. As all five players are checked out, all five players are checked in. Brooke Lopez with Middleton, DiVincenzo, and Holiday. Three duck it all. And I don't know who was the assist already. Van Sinner or somebody. We're, we're getting confused already. Oh, DiVincenzo. A lot of fighting rebound out there. But the savior was on Tobias Harris. Two on one fast break will not be it. Three point I was giving off the mark already. Oh, Greek Freak blocked it. He got the first one to, to attempt it. Not a lot of shot fake before the travel. And a steal by Arna Kupo. Drew Holiday. He slammed it down without a quick sight. Sightseeing out there. I see you, but there is no out, there is no option to face off who is in between, Simmons or Holiday. He's on a lockdown, watch out for those two players. Wow, Joel and B got one in, and a third foul is on Brooke Lopez. Yeah, Brooke Lopez is like just picking up heavy weights out there but he needs to stop pushing it. It's very hard, it's very hard to have a communication on defense, but that will never happen here if he gets it done correctly. Embiid, one free throw left. And that's gonna be in there. They're up by two, well played out there. Holiday again. Finding look is DiVincenzo right to Middleton. Double man on him, which will not count. Finding back is Drew Holiday. Screen on Lopez. He's trying to reach it up. Another steal! He will swoop it up already. Simmons keep missing. We're under three minutes here on a Kupo. He's fouled by Tobias Harris. His second foul. Third team foul on the Sixers. Philadelphia fans complaining about what happened already. This is not turning out that well. Danny Green would have told Tobias Harris to just not, not go too hard on him. You know you gotta watch a heavy man defender. But that's gonna be very tough for him to just shoot. And Giannis is like still looking at the rim. He is not looking away. He's trying really hard, but that doesn't sound the score. It's the first. Looks like Giannis seemingly that they, they wanted to win the first game before uh, before taking the off season uh, before game two. Very convenient. Uh, 
and a second free throw, chops it in. Anakubu, 15 points. Curry against DiVincenzo. Right again, Curry with a two. Oh, what a fancy move out there for Seth Curry. Joel and B, 17, just by Curry. Middleton, round Drew Holiday. And they are getting a tough call on that foul. Another team foul on the Sixers. Doc Rivers is getting a little bit out, getting a little bit up on. Like unbelievable. He's like silent. He's just like, he's like getting a little bit of, getting a little bit of meter. But you want to tell them to back it up. Back up the defender. Not being too hard on him. Drew Holiday. He got 13. He might go for 14. He missed one. He doesn't handle it all, so he just lost it. This will only be one if he makes it. If not, then no free throws. He only hits one, so that will be a trail by that will be a trail for Milwaukee. All round up. Fade with the pass. Simmons outside. Screen on MB. And another foul on the Bucks. It's fourth foul on Brooke Lopez. He says, what? How is this happening? Not a choice here. Another one here for Ben Simmons heading back to the free throw line before the game clock expires down. With 2.12 remaining, they could not stop. Why? Well, that's because of what they've done. Simmons helping a team out and just pick up a height. That's what he does that before. And he makes two. It's 82 to 79 lead. Girale, DiVincenzo, Hitting up a three. It is missed. Two minutes. Two minutes of the fourth period. Another drive for Seth Curry. And they're up again to pick up a lead. Finding over is Steven Chenzo. He goes up. That shot's good. Anakupo receiving the assist. Steven Chenzo only had 17, but Simmons is on a rookie to step up to a pro. And that happened since, yeah, 2018. Uh oh, no foul! Are you kidding me? That's what Joel and B was saying. Are you kidding me? No fouls? Well, that was a weird thing that could happen. Uh oh, Middleton could tie it. And they're trying to answer it back here. Middleton just trying to help him out. He try to tie it? No, sir! He missed it once more, and now we're just going to need to just give it up. Last minute left here. On the island B, up over. No good. Ida Cooper will go ahead and try to give up a run, and he's going to need to try to see what he can do. Middleton. Making a missed shot, another rebound save for Anakubo. He's trying to go from here. Can he try to pick it up? And a foul. Fifth foul on the Sixers. The team foul is giving him trouble. Bonus is on for Milwaukee. If they try to pick it up, then they will. Kubo says like he's like getting tired already. He says, no, don't leave my pressure on. I still have it all. And he has given up. His first free throw was just a devastation for him. So the only one thing is only shoot one and have it up, trail by two. If he does it, then it's all given up broken. He only made one, 
so it's down by two. Simmons on Holiday. Oh, Holiday had still there. And they're going for the tie. Very bad. Giannis saving the day. DiVincenzo trying to deliver a timeout on the Sixers. With 22.9 seconds. And Drew Holiday, I'm going to need to sub him out. I'm going to need to bring, uh, you know what, this is very hard for him to give him a shot. shot offense, they've just got to wait for it. Sorry about that. Now make sure nothing is inside. Only one defenseman player, but it needs to be swift again. And they're going to need to try to fix it up. So we don't want this one to happen here at that moment. Anyway, this is it for, uh, this is it for the Bucks. If they don't have it all, then, then the Sixers would win it. But if they miss it, then they're going to go for a timeout. Dallas present the uh, Jordan New Balance player of the game, and this one is on a Greek free. First game for the Eastern Conference Finals, and that is what they really want, to just psych the feelings, to put the pressure up. Yeah, it was a little bit running late out there. I'm sorry. Oh, running the four will not be in time. Simmons is just trying to wait, but the team is losing down to control under 10 seconds. Simmons thinking, finding a meeting, win it. Oh, and he's done it again. game was not just really difficult. It was not it was not easy for them to just set it all back up. I know this was late, but I just gotta finish it up already. But this is what they really want. To give it all. This is it. If the Bucks don't make the shot, then Sixers will take the first win in game one. This is it for the Bucks. Chris Middleton needs to really need to try it. Can he take it? Oh no! Oh! Unfortunately, the table has overturned Middleton with a save. And just like the first round, Knicks take out the Hawks in game five. Well, it's time to go to the court side of David Aldridge. David, what do you have here? Thank you, Kevin. Giannis, when your group is sharing the ball like this, how dangerous is this team? It can be really dangerous. You know, everybody can make shots. Everybody on the floor, the basketball players. And we, most of all, we're having fun. Always more fun when you win, man. Congrats. Thanks. Back to you, Kevin. All right, DA, thank you so much for watching for the first game of Eastern Conference of the Sixers versus the Bucks. If you'd like to check out last season's that I posted, I'll just follow it on the board and check out the last post that I did here for game one for the start of a last season. I'll have two videos up here, just so don't even try to worry and comply. This will all happen here to be put promise me that I will do it better. And a new show will be The Deals. Why The Deals? <laughs> well, it's a it's a TV show. Uh, that, uh, I'm making a new one. And and it's this is for the suggestions in the comments section below at that point. So the Sixers did not able to make well, would have been able to make the win, but Chris Middleton, the buzz beater killer, like Damian Lillard had in this first game. So that means the Bucks are in the lead now. They will take one nothing for the Eastern Conference. So thanks for watching. Peace out, bitches, for as a while as the NBA Eastern Conference Finals dial. See you on the next game of Game 2 and back to Game 3 in L.A. Have a good night. Bye. Mm -hmm.
probably heard how Tony is so famous. In fact, y'all probably heard how Tony was the greatest. I'm black and proud, honestly, I'm fateless. But y'all whack clown smirk, y'all think I'm faking. But truth be told, y'all turds, y'all just hate. And y'all yearn for rooms is gold in my rankings. All y'all fakest, haters, traitors, y'all are Satan. Y'all keep saying y'all will make it, I'm still waiting.